Hello YouTube. Now I have done a lot of testing lately, like you have seen in my channel, and uh, this is update because there's there is a lot of what has happened. Uh, many new cleaners, vacuums, and uh, some modification or let's say un modifications this time so i have spent a lot of time today to clean my vacuums put new dust back in or clean filters and overall cleaning and uh, let's just start with powerheads uh, like all of you know I like all vacuums that have that power brush roll. I just enjoy using those. And uh, now what I have done, I have stripped my hoses so that they are original and uh, not that wire go going anymore inside the hose and uh, causing all kind of troubles what I have had. So now let's take example here. Philips has this connection now there. Uh, yes, I know that's not prettiest side, but <laughs> closest to the original that I can get and all those works. And I have just this one wire to connect vacuums with the powerhead outlet to the powerhead. And uh, looks need needs this because it has that own look there. So looks Philips and uh, I can now use same system Electrolux still has that same built in hose uh, <laughs> built in cable for this Electrolux powerhead and uh, yes all is cleaned this is holiday video so called Lux has still Just in the bag because I use that to clean my other vacuums and uh, actually I clean it looks with looks <laughs> so yes and Philips had quite big uh, not big I mean full bag so now there is just the, this shake out bag I don't currently have bags for this. Uh, it gets just quite expensive when I do a lot of testing with those packet cleaners and the nail fisk in its aluminium body as new bag and uh, I have not still polished it, but uh, to me that looks good enough, but I will do that. Okay, new bag. And the uh, Electrolux completely cleaned everything, pin and uh, cyclone and filters and so on. So, yes, that has still that overhead connection there. Yes, so these are my canisters now. Uh, I don't know how this happened, but uh, this, those vacuums just keep coming. I always spot something and uh, I just want to buy it and uh, or some, <laughs> something like that. Well, you know, many of you know, know what I am talking about. So 
then I actually like more <laughs> right now than I thought I would but ah, it's a pretty much tie 50-50 now of course this is my pride and joy Kirby I have still a lot of learning to do with that here is that new bag uh, and that professional Kerser who copied the Sibo <laughs> Sibo PS 36 design Kerser didn't want to design their own vacuum so they just took the Sibo's design and made that outside look a bit different yes now I don't know if this light is a bit too bright okay yes and then there's this so called transformer vacuum sark so this is so nice so nice vacuum I would never have guessed how much I like that and this is most likely the vacuum that will be doing my day to day cleaning and uh, then there is this fun little vacuum a bit undertaker undertaker but I still like that I still like that it's fun to use and uh, if you don't expect too much it's it's totally fine I don't have a lot of money to buy constantly new vacuums or expensive vacuums so this is my collection for now and uh, I hope you have liked my videos and um, yes now Kerber is about that price well I got it cheap so I was able to buy that so very good deal that was yes so all these are cleaned also very thoroughly so uh, because uh, I was in uh, my vacuum was in that state that I did some test with some vacuum and then I just didn't clean that and uh, it ended up like that that me, all my vacuums all, almost all my vacuums needed serious serious cleaning to do so yes okay this was some kind of holiday update video and uh, have a nice holiday everyone who is watching and uh, take care and uh, it's good bye